Hello, welcome to Kentucky Brew Reviews. I'm Domingo. Special K. Tonight we're doing a highly requested uh, concoction. I'm going to call it a concoction because that's what it is. Uh, Jack Daniels Winter Jack. It's Tennessee cider. It is a seasonal blend of apple cider liqueur and Jack Daniels Tennessee whiskey. 15% alcohol by volume and it does have caramel color added. Meaning it probably has very little Jack Daniels in it. Yeah, yeah. Um, I like the deer on the label. I like the label. Um, Evan did one? Does Evan do this? There was somebody that did something similar though. I uh, maybe that. Jack. I have, we have another bottle somewhere down, back there. I don't remember who. Yeah. It almost reminds me of the Game of Thrones. Yeah. A uh, bit. Johnny Walker label too, a little bit. Just because it's white. Yeah. It's about the same, but... yeah. What was that one called? Winter Walker or some shit like that? White Walker. White Walker, yeah. Yeah. It says serve warm, um, but this is room temperature, so... That's close enough to warm. I don't think we want Jack Daniels. Serve with warm. friends and family. I believe you qualify. Oh, that's a nice saying. In Kentucky, everybody's family. <laughs> <laughs> that can be taken many ways. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say. <laughs> Inbreeding, yes. <laughs> Blue people. But you're thinking of West Virginia. Yeah, yeah. Sorry if anybody lives in my <laughs> It's fine. That smells so much hotter than it apple actually juice. is. It's 15% alcohol by volume. It literally looks like apple juice. Yeah, it's pretty. It is apple juice colored. Cinnamon, very cinnamon forward. Yeah. Oh, no. It smells like... And a lot of apple. I barely, I barely smell. You can get like a little bit of like oak character and that's it. It smells like it's something that's like, like 60 or 80 proof. Yeah. It doesn't smell like anything that's like 15% alcohol, 30 proof. No, this, you know what it reminds me of? Like, like some apple crown or something. Yeah. Or it's like a, the Apple Jack Daniels. Mm -hmm. I wonder if it is Apple Jack Daniels. What is the ABV on it again? 15%. 15. No. Yeah. No. And this bottle's like. No. Like almost 20 bucks. No. Let's do it. Okay, well, it tastes a lot less alcoholic than it smells. No, it's pretty good. And it's not as cinnamon forward as it smells. No, it smells very cinnamon forward. It's actually a lot it's more It's a good apple. balance of apple and cinnamon, yeah. honestly. And you get a little bit, you get a, a tiny bit of, like, warmth on the throat. It's and not then, much. And, like, a little vanilla and a little, like, barrel character. It, it's okay for what it is. It has a, a decent amount of cinnamon in there, but, yeah, it's more apple- I was afraid it was going to be like potpourri, like yeah. based on the smell. The problem with this is it's 15% alcohol yeah. for this whole bottle. Yeah. And like, just buy you a bottle of wine for like 10 bucks. Like, you're going to be, and if you're going to be drinking this, you're not going to be mixing this. You can't, right. like, you, you I can mean, we are it. for the video, but you can mix it, but you're probably not. This is probably best served a little bit warm. I mean, this is basically just a hot toddy in a bottle. Yeah. You could also, I would say, probably add more Jack Daniels to it. And some lemon. Yeah. So, we're going to mix it with some Mott's Tots here. Some apple juice. Yes, I have uh, child apple juice because I have a child. That's, man, sometimes that's the only way to get on a poop. You know what I'm saying? Apple juice does wonders look for at, that. Look, look at the, the, oh, the beauty, man. That's the beauty of the, uh, the bottle. The carton, I guess. Straight, uh, I think it's a solid seven. It's good. I feel like a boxer when they're sitting on that. Uh, it's a solid seven. It. It's a solid seven straight. I'm taking a half point off for being expensive. Um, Evan Williams makes one, so does. Um, but you can also make this yourself pretty easily with some Jack Daniels, some apple liqueur, or, or some like apple even Jack. some apple cider out the uh, yeah. the gallon. So there's that. Um. I would give it like a like a six. Like it's just overpriced and the ABV is low. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And you could make this like if you have a bar in your house and you have whiskey, like just go get some apple juice or some apple cider. I would say throw some yeah. cinnamon in there maybe. Like I would say one third apple juice to two thirds Jack Daniels. That makes it about ten percent alcohol, and then yeah. I add a, mix it with the cinnamon stick. Yep, yeah. and, you, and you're yeah. in there and yeah. warm it up. Yep. Yeah. So let's try it mixed. Um, I did. I just did like, like I said, one third. It still pretty cinnamon forward. I like honestly maybe have to have to. Yeah, it's still pretty cinnamon forward. Uh huh. 
And all that is is it makes it more drinkable than um, it already was. It tones down any of the cinnamon a lot. Just apple. Yeah. And it's almost unbearably sweet. It's pretty sweet, but I don't I wouldn't go unbearable. We've had a lot of sweet things tonight though, so that might be Yeah, nice. I mean it is pretty sweet. Uh this Mott's apple juice here has forty percent less sugar than normal apple juice, which Says is it right there. Helpful, I yeah. guess. I mean I guess so there's just no regular added there's no added sugar. Yeah, I they guess. probably it's just, just straight the from apples. the apple. Yeah. Straight from the apples, but that would be the apple's butt right there. I mean, mixed, I don't know why you wouldn't mix it, but it, mm -hmm. if you had an issue with it straight, it clears up all the issues. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? But I don't think it's necessarily better mixed. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, it's, you know, if you were like going to, if it was really cold outside, snowing, you know, I would, I might mix Just it with drink some, it out the bottle. I might mix it with some hot cider. Like, yeah. splash it with a yeah. hot cider in there or something. But again, if I you was going to do that, that with Jack Daniels, I would just do it with Applejack. Get a bottle of yeah. Applejack Daniels yeah. or, a, you know, Bird Dog Apple. Put a splash of, you know, Apple Bourbon or in even, there. Or even, doesn't Evan make an apple? Yeah. If it's you're not mixing good, it, but if you're mixing it, it doesn't matter, though. It's nice because it's easy and you can pick it up and go, but the yeah. downside is... I would is, say if you're going to a party or something and you don't want to do with, like, the, the prep time, it would be a good choice. But, like, if you're just trying to make something similar to this like you can do it for cheaper and control the abv more and by just probably doing it yourself. Have better apple flavor yeah because let's be real whatever apple that it's uses in here has to be stuck a shelf stable you can get some good yeah you know apple cider some old that mold apple cider mm -hmm. and then that would be delicious with it with mm -hmm. like some apple jack daniels you know it's sort of like when you buy those jack daniels and cokes that are already made yeah that, like why yeah just buy jack and coke and or, from or the whole thing with seltzers. Right. Buy vodka and a LaCroix. Right, vodka and LaCroix oh. or Costco brand seltzer water, whatever yeah. you need. Kroger brand sparkling beverage yeah, water. Bubbly like or whatever. 30 cents yeah. for a bottle of that. And then throw some lime juice in there, you're good. Like, and, and I'm not going to recommend it because of that reason. I can go buy yeah. a bottle of Apple Jack Daniels and a bottle of cider and make something that's substantially better than this. For cheaper, probably. Yeah, cheaper. for substantially cheaper. Yeah. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend it either. Like, it's good. Yeah, it is good. I'm not saying if you want to go try it, it's good, and you don't mind spending the money right. know, on this, go for it. But, but I just don't see the point of it in the marketplace. That's my thing. Yeah, I agree. Like, yeah. All right, well, that has been our episode. If you would like to see anything else on the channel, you can leave a comment down below. Don't forget to hit that like button. I'm Special K. I'm the Mingo. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching.